All right, SOBs, we're back out here in the Sedge Islands, and we stopped because we saw, let me see if you guys will be able to see this on camera as we walk up, but there are tons of fiddler crabs over here. Probably, oh, oh, did you see them moving? Look at them all. I'll try to zoom in, but there are, whoa, tons of them. I'm thinking bad, so I'm not gonna be able to get too far over in there, wow. But there are absolutely tons of fiddler crabs. And there's tons of little bait fish stuck in here too. It's crazy. Yeah, there's all sorts of cool stuff out here. So uh, we're gonna fish for all sorts of stuff. Figure it out. So let's get to it. Oh, look, a crab. A little, little crab. I don't know if you guys can see, it's right there next to these weeds. It'll probably take off as I get closer. Right there. Can't believe he didn't move. Oh, now he did. <laughs> Just scooped this guy up with my hands. He doesn't have any claws left. European green crab. I'll tell you what, guys. You guys really need to not throw these in when you uh, use them as bait. Because they're invasive as hell. And they just are stacking up out here. Look at all these bait fish. I hope you guys can see all those. They're crazy. Tons and tons of bait fish. So. These things are not supposed to be here. So. We're gonna take this buddy and we're gonna chop him in half and uh, we'll go from there. Oh, fishy, right there. It just went right That was there. a striped bass. Huh? That was a striper. I think that's what I saw before then. It looked There's real another real one. Another one? Yeah. All right, guys, we're out here. Saw a couple stripers over here, so we're gonna just try this high low rig. Uh, we got fresh clam on the top, frozen squid on the bottom, and we will see. And those are circle hooks, three yacht, just in case you know if you catch striper, it's legal. You know, you need a circle hook now. All right, guys got the bait pole set up i'm gonna try a few things today but the guy at the boat ramp said he was having some bites on pink so i got these little pink swim baits and i'm gonna give these a try over here where i saw the stripers see if uh these things will eat anything guys we are on we weren't quite ready for this we just pulled up to a new spot threw it out we got hit doesn't seem to be anything big oh <laughs> oh nice dogfish Yeah, he's telling you. <laughs> What's up, bro? I'm trying to help you out. I got the... Don't you need it. Boom! All right, guys. Another one of these dogfish. Decent size lengths. Technically, you can keep these ones. You can't keep the spiny ones. You can keep these ones, though. But, uh... All right. Let him out. Get him out of here. There you guys. All 
All right, guys, that was quick. So we're rebated and we're gonna toss back out. Oh, try not to slide in the mud. Got a little bit of depth there, which is nice. Set my drag so I can take it if it wants to, tighten it a little bit. Big fish will take that if it wants to. Alright, so now we just wait again. Right inside the bag. Bag's cool. I don't think I got whatever was hitting it. Hmm? Whatever was hitting it isn't on here. Alright, guys, waiting for the bait pole to go off again. And I just uh, tied on, you know, a uh, bucktail, a little teaser hook above it, some gulp on them. Just gonna jig them around and see if I can get a fluke or something. back on guys got it got it see probably another dog fishing I guess that's what we've been getting into out here recently yep another dog fish at first I was like what the hell is that but that was a clump of weeds before the dogfish. <sighs> Got this one on the top hook. Let's try to get these weeds off of here. Jeez, bro. This guy's eyes aren't as green as the rest of them, I see. It's interesting. Go guys, let's get them going. Whew. Cool to watch them swim away like that. Alright, I'll cast back out and put a new bait on. I just left the same bait on, see if we can catch anything else. Not too much depth over there, but that's alright. This is like instant. On again. Please. Boom, 
guys. Another one. There he goes. <laughs> Here we go, guys. Oh, not on. Either that or he's running at me. Nope, he's still on. He's just running at me. Right? Yeah. He's just running at me. He's just running at me. How many of these have I caught today? Oh my gosh, four. Come on, man. Sometimes these things pop right out nice and easy, these circle hooks. Other times, they're the biggest pain in my ass ever. There. All right, guys. There's, once again, another smooth dogfish. All right. Go guys. Alright, that's what we started floating away from our last spot because tide's coming in. So Lee's on her paddleboard over there, starting to head back towards the original sandbar slowly. And we are just kind of gonna drift a bit. And I am set up for some fluke, got a bucktail teaser hook, some gulp on him, and I'm just going to jig around. Yeah? 